Now we will see the two more problems in uh, 12th chapter that is the probability. I am starting from model paper 1 that is 29 question in model paper 1. We are doing it as number 1. A ticket is drawn from a bag containing 100 tickets. The tickets are numbered from 1 to 100. Now what is the probability of getting a ticket with a number divisible by 10? Now in this probability even 5 mark also we finished there. First you have to see what is the sample space. What is the sample space? The total number of the outcomes from that experiment. Now what is this experiment here? A bag contains 100 tickets and they are numbered 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 like that up to 100. So sample space S is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 up to 100. Now what is N of S? N of S is equal to how many numbers are there? 100. Then what is the event you should identify? See what is the probability of getting a ticket with a number divisible by 10. So this is your event. So let A be the event, A be the event of getting, of getting a ticket, ticket with a number, with a number divisible by, divisible by 10. So in this set, what are the numbers which are divisible by 10? All multiples of 10 will come. That is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So, those are the number of favorable events. These are total number of events. So, now what is A here? 10, because 10 is divisible by 10. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So, you count here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, totally how many events are there? 10. So, N of A is equal to 10. Now, what is P of A? Probability of getting an event is equal to what is the formula? N of A by N of S. Now, what is N of A here? 10. What is N of S here? 100. 0, 0 cancel, nothing but 1 by 10. That is your probability. See, probability always you should remember N of A by N of S formula. This is the total number of outcomes. These are the number of favorable outcomes. So, if you divide number of favorable outcomes by total number of outcomes, you will get the required probability. That is it. Very simple. Now,